In John chapter 4, we find Jesus having this conversation with the Samaritan woman at Jacob's well. And then we discover that she is a, a very sinful lady, that she is uh, now living with a man. She's living in fornication, and she's had five other husbands, which means that she was in adultery. So, which means according to the law, she should have been stoned. She should have been put to death. She should have been condemned. But what did Jesus do? Jesus initiated grace. Now, we often talk about the grace of God and the grace that God offers, but here it is we find Jesus initiating it. So what we discover in the Word of God, the clear teachings of the Word of God, is that all we like sheep have gone astray, each of us have turned our own way. All have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God, and if we say that we have no sin, we're liars, and the truth is not in us. But you know what? God initiates that grace within us, that, that the Holy Spirit comes to convict our hearts and draw us unto salvation and God wants everybody to be saved, so he draws us into that saving relationship. He loves us enough to draw us into himself to save us from our wretched sins. So what do we have to do? We have to place our faith and our trust in Jesus Christ, turning away from those sins and turning to Jesus Christ as Lord and as Savior. Thank you for watching today. If this video was a blessing to you, then I encourage you to share it so other people can be blessed by the contents of this video as well. Also, I encourage you to go over to my website, RustyCoon.com. You'll see that right below. Uh, where there you'll find a lot more videos as well as a lot more information about uh, Rusty Coon Ministry and its vision. And I pray that it would continue to be a blessing to you as well. God bless.